Dr. Conley, how is metastatic breast cancer treated and how long will this treatment be? Metastatic breast cancer is treated in a number of different ways. We consider, for example, whether radiation might be needed. If somebody has an area of great pain that is not easy to control with painkillers, but more uh, usually it's treated with what we call systemic therapy, which is treatment that covers the entire body. And that can be in either pill form or it can be in the form of an IV drug. And really the type of medicine that we use depends on the type of breast cancer and where the breast cancer is located. So for example, if someone has a hormone receptor positive breast cancer, which is again about two thirds of patients with breast cancer, those patients may benefit greatly from these hormone treatments, which can help to shrink the cancers and keep them in check and improve symptoms. If a patient has a cancer expressing the HER2 protein, we may consider HER2 targeted therapy, either on its own or combined with chemotherapy, or indeed combined with hormone therapy. And if a patient has what we call triple negative breast cancer, we're usually considering chemotherapy as the best treatment option. As we use these treatments, we are going to likely check a scan every two or three months initially to check that the treatment is helping. And if the treatment is helping, we usually continue it as long as it is keeping the cancer in check. If the treatment is not helping, we consider a different treatment. Patients often ask how long they will be receiving those treatments. And in general, for patients with metastatic breast cancer, these treatments are going to become part of their day-to-day -day for the duration of their life. If this is in pill form, I often say, this is like taking your blood pressure medicine constantly or your diabetes medicine. Um, so this is something that is a continuous process to try and keep the cancer cells in check and from spreading to other parts. And it's a constant conversation with your provider as to what the next step is when we do a scan and whether the treatment is helping.